this person has fell or that person has fallen. Make your request known to the Lord. Amen. Who are we to judge that one and say they have fallen? How would we like it if someone got together and spoke of us in that fashion, put ourselves in the other person's shoes, and say restoration and not condemnation? Amen. Glory to God. Praise, praise the Lord. Return to go back unto the Lord. Yes. Return, in spite of all that's happened, in spite of all you've been through, return. Like the prodigal son, return to your first love. Return to your home, your relationship with your God. Mercy, compassion, kindness or forgiveness shown especially, especially, especially to somebody a person has power over. So if you think about this, this is God who spoke the world into existence. This is God that spoke and it was done. This is the same God that can say, take away the way from their breath so that he can live no more. That's the same God we're serving. And he is having mercy. He is having compassion. Amen. He is having love toward each and every one of us in this place. Amen. Glory to God. When you think about the Lord, Think about his mercy and his love towards you. He doesn't want evil to come upon you. He wants good to come upon you all the days of your life if you will seek after him. Bless his name. He has power to give or take away our lives. That power is in his hands and he is willing to show mercy toward us and pardon. When you think of the word pardon, it's release a person from punishment, exempt from penalty. You sin, you made a mistake, you were due for the penalty, but God said, mercy said no. Amen. God said, I'm not finished with him, I'm not finished with her, I'm not finished with them, I still have work for them to do. Amen. Brethren, these are my few words. And I ask you, even after I finish and hand back over the uh, mic to the moderator or bishop, think about the Lord. Amen. I gave you guys a lot of things to think about. Yes. If you say, I don't know what to think about, I give you more than enough. Amen. So think about what he means to you, think about what he's done for you, and think about what he's able to do for you and what he's going to do for you. Because you trust in Him and know all things are possible through Him. Thank you, Jesus. Name.